Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day. So this week I want to make a little bit of a different video and give you guys a bit more of an insight into my kind of day-to-day -day life. And today is a Sunday and there happens to be a secondhand clothing store summer relaunch sale um, on today. And we're currently parked outside, ready to go in. The reason I want to document this and share it with you guys is because I've never actually thrifted or really bought secondhand clothes before. I have once or twice, but I've never gone out on a shopping trip with the intention of buying all secondhand clothes. Um, and the reason being that I've waited so long is because honestly, I haven't really bought any new clothes in such a long time, like many years, it's kind of embarrassing. And the reason that I'm doing it is because I've gotten to a point where I've minimized heaps of my wardrobe. And while I have clothes, while all the clothes that I have left are what I do wear and what I do kind of like to wear, I don't really have anything that I am really passionate about wearing and I love wearing and that I put on and I feel like really, really good in. And I think that I don't know, that's just my feeling with clothes is that I want to put something on and be super like happy with wearing it and really enjoy wearing it rather than it just being something to put on my body to cover up. So that is the purpose of today. I'm not sure how it's going to go. Hopefully we'll find some cool things, but I'm excited to take you along on this journey with me. I really hope you enjoy. But you feel like home mm -hmm. We might have nothing but we're not alone And winter, summer Take all my seasons, you're my rain and snow mm -hmm. All I know is when you're close I forget to breathe Can you see what you've done to me? Oh my, it's crazy Feeling like a symphony is playing Every time I see it's like a daydream I know we've got it right And now it's your forever and it's crazy Every little thing you do is amazing And nothing in the world is gonna face me Cause I know we've got it right And now it's your forever Okay, so it's been a few days now since my thrifting experience and I just wanted to sit down and chat with you about how I found it and my overall thoughts, would I do it again? So I had a really good time, I got some really great stuff for seriously, ridiculously low prices and I would definitely do it again. Obviously, as you saw, this was a really different kind of thrifting to normal thrifting and I want to dive into that a little bit because I'm not sponsored by The Closet or anything like that. I just Think they're really cool so I just want to chat about them so the closet is only about six months old and they're basically an online secondhand clothing store so what happens is that you send your clothes in the team at the closet will meticulously sort through everything and then they'll take photos of them pop them up on their website and then you can go on the website pick what you want and um, they'll send it out to you 
If it doesn't fit, you don't like it for some reason, that's fine. You can get a full refund and send it back. So it's a really different kind of experience. And what also sets them apart from other normal thrift stores is that because everything is so meticulously gone through and sorted by their team, you're getting ridiculously good quality clothes for a seriously low price. They don't really accept anything that um, has stains or marks on it. Sometimes if it's a really beautiful piece of clothing, they will send it to the dry cleaners and then pop it up on their website just because they think it would be even more of a waste to not accept that item of clothing. But basically everything else at the store is either brand new with tags or only worn once or twice. And I think what is so great about the closet and their overall mission is that they are opening secondhand clothes up to a completely different market that would not normally buy secondhand clothes. A lot of people have certain preconceived notions about secondhand clothes and where they come from and you know the whole thought of well why would I waste time sorting through other people's secondhand clothes when I can go out and buy what I want brand new. But because all these clothes are so, in such great condition and they're at such cheap prices, it's really opening up a brand new world of shopping to people who normally like the higher end brands or the designer labels. Not saying that I normally would, but I love the direction that they're taking it in and I love that they are just opening up the option to thrift to a whole new demographic which you know, sustainability and ethically sourced clothes are the future. And I think that companies like this are really just getting the ball rolling even more and it's really, really exciting to see. So I would say that that was a very successful and very lucky way to dip my feet into the water of thrifting. It's something that I will definitely do more in the future and I'm sure it will be a lot more of a normal style of thrifting where it might take a little bit more time, I might have a little bit less luck, but you never know, there are always gems out there and everyone has different styles. So what someone might throw away and really not like, another person could absolutely adore and it's like the piece that perfectly encapsulates who they are as a person. So I will definitely be thrifting more and I will share my experience with normal thrifting on here as well if you're interested. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Let me know if you want me to do more videos like this in the future. And I upload new videos every Thursday. I really, really can't wait to see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.